Hello and welcome to the short video looking at the Mike Hawthorne crash. Now Mike Hawthorne was a famous racing driver who had been world champion in 1958. He'd retired at the end of that season due to ill health uh, because one of his kidneys had failed and he hadn't been given very long to live. Mike had a Jaguar 3.4 litre saloon registered VDU881, which had been loaned to him by Jaguar when he was racing for them, and Lofty England had allowed him to keep using the car after he retired from racing. On the 22nd of January 1959, he left his garage at Farnham, which he owned, which was called Tourist Trophy Garage, and headed up to Guildford. He joined the A3 Guildford Bypass, and overtook Rob Walker's Mercedes 300 SL. The Jaguar lost control just after he had overtaken Rob and skidded across the road, colliding with a lorry, a traffic island, and then a tree. The car was completely wrecked. Hawthorne was killed instantly. Rob Walker was the first on scene and raised the alarm. The remains of VDU881 were taken back to Jaguar and went for scrap. The, somebody has since made a replica of VDU881, but because of the DVLA policy of not reissuing plates once a car's been scrapped, they weren't allowed to have a VDU881 on it. However, the reverse 881 VDU was available, so that is what they have on it. Well, I hope you enjoyed the short video, and I will see you in a future video. Thank you for watching.